You know what? No, no. I've got a perfect way to explain this. He's a GTA protagonist. Like, like he's coarse and crude and, like, lower... Like, he comes across as someone who should be in the gutter, but he's smart and ambitious and he's on top instead, right? So he's, like, a thug who is a mafia don, and I love this, this, this presentation of him. Wakey, wakey, Wayne! I always knew you, you was the man doing it! What? Now, where did it enter the room? I don't know, man. Where could it be? Up there! No. And yeah, I, I would agree. The Joker in the previous game was completely sane, as I've said many times. This one... <laughs> Throw a smoke bomb, break your face, and string me up from the ceiling? How's he gonna do that? He can't do that! Kenny? I thought you said we were in control. I did. I, I mean, we are. Look, there's four of us, just one of him. I saw him take out ten people back at the asylum. Would you just shut the hell up? Okay, new plan. We kill him now. What? Yeah, let's do it. Okay. One, two... Are you sure? Won't Harley be pissed? Why should she care? One, two... Do we shoot on three? Guess on three! Like one, two, three, shoot! Okay, okay, let's just get it done. This is freaking me out. Good! Now, one, two, three... Where's he gone? He's vanished! At least in the movie. I was looking for something else. Not that. Thought I heard some. <laughs> What? Well, I think we all got a little bit biased by Bales. <laughs> Excuse me. God, that actually hurts my throat doing that. Holy crap. So, this is actually pretty cool. Check it out. So there's Joker's territory. Cobblepot's territory, and up there you can see dense territory. Also, notice that he's trying to claim chunks of the middle section here. I love this. This is this is so unnecessary and yet so awesome that they put this in here, in my opinion. Anyways. I hope you're lying there, desperately trying to breathe through fractured ribs and punctured lungs. And if you're not, oh, you better summon up whatever strength you've got left and run. Because after I'm done with the bat, you're all next. He's, um, he's got some issues, I think. I'm sorry, what? Positive ID on Batman. He's engaging multiple enemies. We have zero visual on Batman. Augmented reality training activated. Augmented uh. reality training complete. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine I'm, you know, the lore runner, and I encounter the Takoda, and we're allies, right? Like, we are literally on the same side, and I'm like, alright, Takoda, I need to go save Threeburn, and Takoda's like, wait, we need to save Don Crow first, and I'm like, but, but no, Threeburn is more important to me, and Takoda's like, no, Don Crow is more important to me, and then we start fighting. <sighs> And then we have this whole knockdown fight of just ridiculous proportions as we're basically trying to kill each other. And then when the fight's over, what almost always happens is, okay, let's go, let's go get three burn first. Okay, high five. And then they just go, <laughs> and then it's over. And then, and then there's no, there's no hostility. There's no hard feelings. It's just, okay, we've done the fight now. We can move on. What ha what went through my head there? Because I didn't vocalize this. Hey. Uh... Kikoriko. 
was I was down there looking at the giant group of things. I was like, oh, I don't want to fight that big group of guys. And then I realized this is city, not asylum. And then my and no joke, the very next thought, as soon as I realized this was city, not asylum, was, oh, I can't wait to fight that giant group of guys and somehow leave the Riddler guy alive. <laughs> There's an interesting question. What kind of villain would I be? What kind of villain would you be in the Bats verse? Presume you can't have like any real superpowers, and you have to have a big gimmick, right? Like that's that's kind of the shtick for being a Batman villain is you have to have a gimmick. So what's your gimmick? I know what mine would be, of course. Oh wait, that's taken. Ooh, Duncan, don't I would kill. Everyone in chat for some donuts! I, or, I mean... Look, I like donuts, okay? Yeah, what are you? Oh, God. Hi. There's nothing to see in here. You should go away. <laughs> Who'd have figured? Saved by the Batman. Wow, I thought he'd attack me. Holy crap. Brain having. He attacked me! He attacked me! <laughs> My flesh is begging you to fail, Batman. Will you? Ring, ring. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. That sentence, taken out of context. My flesh is begging you to fail. It's okay, someone died because Batman wanted to catch Deadshot. Because, I mean, we're not trying to make the world a better place here. Right? Like, that's, that's not our goal. So the game crashed. Hard crashed. Give it up already! No way you'll get me! Really? Uh, what? What? Happened? The freaking man! No! 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 Zaz! Go on, Ben! Run away! Answer. God damn it! You stoop! You don't matter! You don't matter! When you die, no one will even notice! <laughs> Jesus Christ, just die! You pissant! Die! God damn it! <laughs> Why one negative? Nobody, nobody cares about the 14 positives. All everyone cares about is the one negative. This is so human. It's funny. Every it's funny to me. Every time this happens, I'm like, "All right, so there's this video game I'm going to review. It's a 17 billion plus to story, one negative." And everyone in the audience says, "Wait, what's the negative? What's the negative? Tell me what the negative is, Lore. Swear to me." Everyone everyone grabs Lore. "You will tell me. Where is the negative? Where is that?" <laughs> the dark night. Thank you.